Hey everybody, I'm Carissa, and the apps that I want to show you today are for toddlers. So, I, as you all might know, I have a two-year-old. He's in the back seat. He's, I'm sure he's probably going to start screaming at some point. But I use these apps with him. He really likes them, and they're really cute. They're some of my favorite ones. So, the first one I want to show you is called Squiggles, and it's pre it's a pretty easy app. It's really basic. They can use it themselves. So it teaches you, you can pick between the different things that you could teach them. So it says learn how to tap, swipe, shake, or all. So if you click tap first, let's say we want to go through that first. If you can see, let me see. So you tap it and look. And it has cute little faces that come up and they make a noise. And when you tap it, it just goes to the next screen. I think this is so cute. I don't know. And that's really all it does, but he seems to love it. It entertains him. Not for too long. I mean, he's two, but... And then you can go back. So that was teaching them how to tap. You can click on swipe. And you literally... It's the same thing, except this time tapping won't do anything. So it's teaching them to swipe. And you could swipe up, down, back, forth, either way. Left, right. And then the last one is shaking. So it's as simple as literally, you just shake the iPad and it changes faces. So it's kind of teaching them to do different types of things with the iPad, or and then you can do, there's also a feature where it does all three. So tapping it will make the noise, swiping it'll move it, or shaking it'll move it. So that's called Squiggles. I love this app, I just think it's so cute. Okay, so the next one is Animal Builder. This one is really cute too. It takes a second to load though. All right, so you hit play, and it takes you to a few different eggs, and you can pick an egg. You can open up. It hatches the egg. That guy's in that one. You can open them all, and you can kind of see. I'm just turning the volume up. You can kind of see. So those are the different ones. The, the two on the bottom aren't unlocked yet because we didn't get that far um, with the app. So let's say we click on this guy right here. Okay, so he goes to the... Ooh. Hello. Okay, so he said mouth please. So what you do is you open the boxes and you see the different parts. So this box happens to have the mouth. So you take the mouth. I can say bye bye. <laughs> I don't know. I just think this is so cute. Okay, and then there's different ones here. These are the, Oh, these are eyes. So if you want to, you could take away the eyes that he has and you could put different eyes on. Now I can see you. <laughs> So, and it kind of, it tells them what the different functions do. So they, you know, I don't know, it's kind of like a little fun educational thing. I think it's adorable. All right. And then there's different, different boxes. So this box has different noses. All right. Different. All right. And you kind of move everything around to where it goes and then you can swipe. Whoops. And then you get more boxes. So there's different things in each of the boxes. So there's a leg. <laughs> I don't know. I just think this is so cute. So, and then here's a fun thing. When your kid is fin done with their monster, if they want to save it or their animal, I guess, you just hit the camera. And it takes a picture. And see, there it is. And if you go back to the home screen, you could click here and go see a picture and all your monsters are there and then it automatically saves one to your camera roll. So, ooh. okay, I see you. So it's really cute, it talks to you. I don't know, I have so much fun with this. Okay, and the last one is called I Hear Oo, E-W-E. And it goes over all the different animal sounds. So for example, if I click on, click on the pig. This is the sound a pig makes. <laughs> The guy doesn't have kind of a little bit of a creepy voice, but you get the point. And then they have, I think that's so cool, they even have a zebra. This is the sound a zebra makes. I never really knew what sound a zebra makes, so that's cute. And then they have different types of vehicles. So if you click here in the fire truck. This is the sound a fire truck makes. <laughs> that was loud. Okay, and then here's the fun part about this app. You click the little, you probably can't see it. There's a little I button and you could change the language. So if you could see, there's all different languages. So like, let's click Spanish. Did I click Spanish? Nope, I click Korean. Okay, let's click Spanish and now go back and everything is in Spanish. El pez hace. 
So I don't speak Spanish, so I have no idea if she was saying the right thing or not, but I'm sure that she is. So the languages are Chinese, English, German, Japanese, Korean, and Spanish. So it's really cool. These are all free apps. They're good for your toddlers and maybe babies too. I don't know. I didn't really let Joey use the iPad when he was that little. But he loves them now, and they're just something fun that they, he can do on his own. So I hope you guys enjoyed that, and I will post the, um, the names to all the apps in this post. All right? Talk to you guys soon. Bye.